नमस्कार आई अमित कुमार वेलकम यू ऑल इन आई एम डीज डेली वेदर ब्रीफिंग सो इफ यू लुक एट ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स रेनफॉल विच वॉज रिकॉर्डेड टूडे एट एट थर्टी आई एस टी देन यू कैन सी दैट इन तमिलनाडु वेरी हैवी रेनफॉल वॉज रिकॉर्डेड ओवर चेन्नई दैट इज सेवेंटीन सेंटीमीटर्स ऑफ रेनफॉल हैज अकर्ड और तेलंगाना ओवर हैदराबाद नाइन सेंटीमीटर्स एंड जनगांव सेवन सेंटीमीटर्स ऑफ रेनफॉल हैज अकर्ड एन आई के इन बिदर डिस्ट्रिक्ट सेवन सेंटीमीटर्स ऑफ रेनफॉल हैज अकर्ड इन लास्ट ट्वेंटी फोर आवर्स सो इफ यू लुक एट टूडे इज वेदर सिस्टम्स विच आर प्रिवेलिंग ओवर इंडिया देन द कंडीशंस आर बिकमिंग फेवरेबल फॉर द विड्रॉल ऑफ साउथ वेस्ट मानसून फ्रॉम पार्ट्स ऑफ नॉर्थ वेस्ट राजस्थान मेनली फ्रॉम वेस्ट राजस्थान एंड फ्रॉम सम रीजन्स ऑफ कच फ्रॉम अराउंड ट्वेंटी थर्ड ऑफ सेप्टेम्बर देन द लोकेशन ऑफ मानसून ट्रफ today is that the monsoon trough is located to the south of its normal position and it is currently passing through bikaner guna mandla rajnandgaon gopalpur and then it is going to east central bay of bengal then yesterday cyclonic circulation over rajasthan and punjab they have merged together and now there is cyclonic circulation over north rajasthan which is currently prevailing then there is a east west shear zone Uh, from west central bay of bengal to thailand there are two separate cyclonic circulation one over west central bay of bengal and another over uh, northern parts of thailand the cy- cyclonic circulation over thailand it is likely to move in west northwest direction and then under the influence of both of these uh, cyclonic circulation a low pressure area is likely to form over uh, west central bay of bengal by around 20 third of uh, september so if we talk about the highlights of uh, today's presentation then under the influence of these two cyclonic circulation when there a low pressure area will form over west central bay of bengal and then the likely movement of that low pressure area towards india then it is it is expected that from 23rd of september uh, rainfall activity even uh, means heavy rainfall activities likely to happen over parts of east india that is the coastal belt of east india then uh, north peninsular india central india and uh, the second highlight is that over uh, northeast region uh, from day 4 to day 5 that is from 23rd of uh, september the rainfall activity is likely to pick up and heavy rainfall activity will continue for next uh, from day number 4 to day number 7 so if we talk about the rainfall warnings for day 1 then you can see that uh, heavy rainfall activity may occur over coastal andhra pradesh telangana north interior karnataka and tamil nadu then uh, heavy rainfall activity may also happen over nmmt thunderstorm activity is likely to happen over all the parts of central india and adjoining north peninsular india hot and humid conditions are likely to prevail over entire northeast on day 1 and day 2 if we talk about rainfall warnings for 22nd of september then the hot and humid conditions will prevail complete northeast then heavy rainfall activity is likely to happen over nmmt cap nik sik and thunderstorm activity is likely to continue over east india central india and adjoining north peninsular india on 23rd under the influence of that low pressure area which is likely to form over west central bay the rainfall activity will increase over uh, coastal andhra pradesh then telangana nik vidarbha chatisgarh thunderstorm activity is likely to continue over central india north peninsular india and east coast in the, our northeast india heavy rainfall activity is likely to happen over whole of northeast on day 4 that is on 24th of uh, september the heavy rainfall belt is likely to shift slightly westward and heavy rainfall activity is likely to happen over uh, rayalaseema telangana chatisgarh vidarbha mp maratwada and konkan and goa 
over complete northeast uh, rain, heavy rainfall activity is likely to continue on 24th september also for 25th september the rainfall activity will uh, further advance somewhat uh, westward and heavy rainfall activity is likely to happen over whole of central india and adjoining northern parts of peninsular india and over west coast over gujarat konkan goa and madhya maharashtra in northeast india and east india particularly gwb bihar also the heavy rainfall warnings are given for 25th of september on 26th of september heavy rainfall activity is likely to happen over mp vidarbha chatisgarh konkan goa madhya maharashtra and entire northeast on 27th of september complete northeast that is the whole uh, regions of northeast will continue be under heavy rainfall warning and uh, over central india also over mp vidarbha konkan goa gujarat and madhya maharashtra heavy rainfall is likely to continue so i thank you all for joining us in this weather update you can join us on our website on our social media handles and on our mosam app where you will be updated with the latest weather warnings <music>